welcome to a resurrection episode of Tech Tuesday with Scale Science. I'm your host Jordan, and today we'll be talking about the SkyRC Bluetooth Corner Balance Weight System. When it comes to fine tuning your drift setup, a corner scale can really become a game changing device, allowing you to really look into all of the fine aspects of why your car performs the way it does and help you pinpoint areas in which you can improve. 1500. Today we'll be walking you through using this Bluetooth scale while we set up Project RTR, another series we're running here on our Scale Science YouTube channel, so be sure to subscribe and check out that video here. Now let's begin by logging in to Google Play or the iTunes Store and downloading the RC Gears app. Next we will turn our scales on. Included in your kit are some labels which will help identify the location of each and make setup within the app much simpler and straightforward. Make sure you put them on. Once all four are blinking and in connection mode, open the RC Gears app and select Corner Weight System. A quick Bluetooth scan will identify all four of your scales and allow you to proceed to the next step. Your initial setup will require you to identify these locations, but after the first time, they will stay locked in until you should delete or change them. And you can do both of those things at any time within the app. Once you're ready, press enter and you will go within the scale system itself. By hitting tear, you will ensure all of the scales are zeroed just make sure that you have no debris or anything on top of your scales when tearing. Ensure they remain at zero and you can begin. An important note when putting something on to weigh, try to center it as best as possible on each of the scales as I did notice some differentiation between weights on the scale system if they were not perfectly centered. Now let's talk about what you'll see on the screen. Starting from the top, you're gonna get a front weight. That's gonna be the weight combined between the front two scales. You'll have an individual left and right front weight as well shown. You can also compare the weights side by side and front to back with the percentage. The percentage is really helpful in just making quick judgment calls, not getting too hung up on being gram for gram exact. Although it is definitely the target you should aim for. The lower portion of the screen will cover both left and right individual weights, total rear weight, and total overall weight of all four scales. It's also going to give you a cross weight, which is the right front, left rear, left front, right rear, um, to show you a percentage of how the chassis is biased. And that will definitely clue you into some of its characteristics when it's driving. And if you find something that you like, you can begin to imitate that on other chassis in utilizing some of their adjustments and things to move it into a weight bias that you feel comfortable with on your driving style. Another feature of this Bluetooth scale system I really like is its overall size. Within its packaging, it takes up next to no room in my pit bag and gives me a really powerful tool at my fingertips when I'm track side and trying to fine tune and dial in my car. Then having all of the numbers and settings within the phone makes it easy to take screenshots to document and keep track of my changes as I move through the day and I can go back and see all of the changes in a physical copy that I will have retained within the cloud. Now they may be simple, but these corner balance scales really hold great wisdom and knowledge when it comes to having insights in your setup on your car. Putting it down on the track is the most important part and being able to do that fast and efficiently with something like this scale system is 
absolutely a reason why I think you should put one in your pit bag and make sure you have it ready anytime you need to know. If you're ready to take the plunge, we have these scales available at scalesciencerc.com for $129.99. You can find the link in the description. 